morning. It is 3.42 in New York, and we are live once again. It's Oil Money Gang, and we're going to take a look at West Texas Intermediate Crude Oil. And as you recall from the previous video we had, we had a limit order, sell limit, but we never got triggered in, unfortunately. It's all good. Uh, it's all good. Um, this triple top is very interesting, though. I am confident that that's the next draw. Excuse me, on liquidity. So right now, price tried down towards our target as we had anticipated. The target in question is a... Excuse me, let's just go back here. Hmm. We currently are in a weekly fair value gap and as well as or rather what I was particularly paying attention to was this daily level here where we just 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 you know missed it <clears throat> I'm just gonna adjust my levels for increased accuracy there put that down there and yeah for this one it's quite simple really take it down, shoot it all the way up. With oil production and all of that going on and such, um, word on the street is we can see a $100 barrel of crude oil. So that's just what we have in mind. Price is doing its thing. Um, yeah, I hope it doesn't take off without me. I'm being very strict. I'm only waiting for that level. Yeah, it's looking like she just might start moving. She just might start moving. But if she moves without me, it is what it is. I will just be watching for paper trading. I am was definitely waiting for this level, uh, that daily fair value gap to be hit. Right now, price is currently hanging around in a weekly fair value gap, and that's fine. We'll see what it does for us. Yeah, no lie, man. I'll really be irritated if she leaves without me. But like I said, I am waiting for that level over there. No compromises, and we'll see what happens. Let's just check out the crude oil, Brent Cash. See what's going on on that side. Of course, obviously, similar situation set up. Uh, you know, just got to be patient with it, you know. You must just be extremely patient. Four hour time frame, all right. Nothing fancy. The daily time frame. Let's see here. Any yeah, any just buy a contract. Oh, that's a lot of contracts. Whoopsie. Let me see. One week. No. Oh, she could potentially. A little bit lower, right? Mm, impulsive purchase on my part, but uh, we got the capital for it. It's not really a problem. Well, it is, but you know, we'll just continue to watch and see uh, what happens here with the oil. Yeah, man, she can do what she does. Okay, I should probably close this position. If I'm being, if I'm being 100 with myself, I shouldn't chase price. I'll just put my stop there, and we'll see what happens. If I'm out, I'm outie. If I'm out, I'm outie. I ain't even tripping. So cool, that's the situation right now. Definitely looking for those highs to be taken out. Was definitely looking for it to get to a hundred dollars per barrel. But we'll see what happens. I'll keep you all posted. And yeah, man. Well money gang.